Hello Factions people, I'm Tactical Napper and welcome to the Bobby Barks 1v1 tournament match featuring Murderboy88 and t -Lu Gamer. t -Lu Gamer lands a hunting rifle shot. Murderboy88 is going to back off. He's got the 9 mil, lands a couple. Rushes him with a bow. And he's just been marked by t -Lu Gamer. He's going in though. Each of them land a body shot. And Murderboy88 finishes off the second body shot, securing the first down of the game and that first special execution. Back with Murderboy88 here in the 24 hour. He lands one bow shot, throws in a smoke, and he looks like he's going to rush in. Lands the second bow shot, and he's up by two. Now with t -Lu Gamer's perspective, they're dancing around the ambulance. t has got a HR, he misses the first shot. Pulls out the nine. Oh, he's not capitalizing on those shots. He can't down Murder Boy, and Murder Boy lands that second bow shot. I thought for sure that t -Lu would have him as he was climbing up that ambulance, but he just didn't capitalize on those nine mil shots. With t -Lu again, he's not switched to a burst rifle. And Murderboy drops him with a bow headshot. Ouch. Murderboy is proven to be uh, pretty effective with that bow and aggressive. He's with Tilo again by the mail truck, and he goes down again to a headshot. Wow. Alright, let's see what we can do here with Tilo Gamer. Oh, he gets hit with the one bow shot. Lands one burst, but. Murder Boy gets him with that second shot again, going in for the special execution. And he's quickly down by five. Here with Murder Boy's perspective now. He's gonna go hit the box, why not? Let's grab some stuff. Yeah, and they switch spots. 24 hour. Oh, he lands the two quick body shots again. And we're at a 7 spawn deficit. t -Lu Gamer's going to really have to change his game up if he wants to stick with this match. He grazes him with the shorty. Of course the shorty came out. Oh, this one. He gets the shorty down, securing his first down of the game at the 9 minute mark. We're now 19 to 13. Oh, he lands one burst. Is he going to push in? Uh, he's going to give Murder Boy time to heal up. Tito is following around. He's the one bow shot and the second bow shot. He does not land any of those shorty shots. Here with Murder Boy again. They're around the ambulance. Tilo climbs up on top and marks him. He gets one shot. Two shots. He's firing on single shots. Oh, he's got the shorty out. Is he going to capitalize and finish it? He does. Finish it off with the shorty. Now we're sitting at 18 to 12 with about seven minutes left. T Lu Gamer again with the shorty. Oh, and he did not see Murder Boy up there as he filled him full of 9 mil rounds. Not good for T Lu Gamer. There's still time though. T Lu Gamer again, he's crafted a one hit stick. He's looking for Murder Boy. When Murder Boy comes around the corner, I don't think he saw T Lu Gamer there because T Lu uh, Gamer dropped him with that one hit stick. Excellent work. And now they're climbing over the van. They're both armored up. Tilo Gamer lands the two bursts. Does not take the helmet off though. But uh, he's slowly clawing his way back into this match. 
Murder Boy throws a smoke, but does not land. Tilu Gamer throws a Molotov, and he's in behind him with the one hit stick again. These one hit sticks are proven to be very effective for Tilu Gamer. Oh, Tilu Gamer lands the one burst. He's going to push in, try and get him before he heals up. He's got to go quick, though. He's healing. And he's healed. He's got him with the shorty, but he gets the two shorty shots. Murder Boy doesn't get away in time. Excellent work by Tilu Gamer on being persistent and pushing up. Murder Boy 8 again here. Tilu throws a bomb, does not land. Murder Boy's going to climb up on the sandbag, see what he can see. Tilu threw a smoke, also did not connect. Oh, Tilu's got his armor. He's got him weakened now. Murder Boy's going to back off and try and heal up. He's going to have to get out of the way though, as Tilu is pursuing. He's got the shorty out, and he finishes him off. Excellent work by Tilu. He's been changing his game up to be a little bit more aggressive and push Murder Boy. He throws a molly, weakens him up a bit. Smoke come in, now he's rushing. He gets one burst, clips him with another, and finishes him off with the shorty again. We're down to one at a 12-11 game. We'll turn this into a match. Murder, Murder Boy throws a smoke, it's not gonna connect. And he's back on his heels. I can't say I blame him. Tilu's been relentless. And Tilu throws another smoke. And this one does connect. He's going to go in for the dirty shiv. Nope. He's going to give him some burst body shots instead. And we're all tied up. Tilu has definitely made a comeback. He was down by seven spawns. And he's got a one hit stick again. He's going to rush in and skate to the finish line. I think he just took yeah, he took just took the lead for the first time in the game at the 20 second mark. Tilu Gamer has come back and he's gonna might be able to get another engagement here. Yeah, looks like he's going for it. Which is risky. One arrow. Oh, and time is on Tilu Gamer's side in that spot there. Excellent match. I'm Tactical Napper. Thanks for having me. Are close. What's going on everyone, Bobby Barks here, and welcome to this round 3 matchup between Kieran W99, who I'll just call Kieran, and Mub X, who will just be called Mub. And we are in the 24 hour hotline straight away here, Kieran using a variable rifle, it looks like Mub has a burst on, and Mub gets the first execution of the game. Unfortunately we don't have any footage from Mub. So we're going to be watching this game from the point of view of Kieran all the way through. In the middle of the checkpoint now, Kieran taking up a position behind the barrels. Mub is pushing forward after seeing Kieran healing and is going to be in a good position here to take a second down. Yes, there it is. And Kieran deliberating on which loadout to go. I don't think he actually changed it there. I think he stuck with his original loadout. Nice headshot from distance. I think by the time he gets there though, Mub will have healed up, throws a bomb in, doesn't get the down, slight hit marker, Kieran's taken some damage as well, both players are going to heal up, Mub is still taking up a position within the convenience store, coming out the back door, getting some nice shots off, taking cover as well, Kieran can't find the right angle, manages to evade the smoke bomb. Very tactical play from both players here as we see a variable against a burst, not for the first time in this round. Mub getting up on top of the van, not always the best of moves, particularly when your opponent knows what's coming, and Kieran gets his first execution of the game. Kieran knows where Mub is, I'm not sure Mub knows where Kieran is, he does now. Takes up cover behind the trash can in the checkpoint, Kieran throws in a bomb, it's a good bomb, it gets the down. Great throwable from Kieran, levelling the match. Mob throwing in a smoke bomb. Nowhere near Kieran though. Not sure if he's using it just for cover. Kieran goes with a Molotov. It's a great Molotov and it gets the execution. And Kieran now takes the lead for the first time in the game. 
Mub doesn't know where Kieran is. He's going to get caught. And he does. Four body shots from Kieran. Gets the down and extends his lead. He's now got a fully upgraded variable. Long range bomb over the top of the ambulance. Doesn't get the down, but it's certainly got some damage. Nice counter though from Mub. And he pulls the score back a little bit to within one. Mub knows where Kieran is, using the ceiling to bank the bomb. Doesn't get the down though. Kieran manages to evade it pretty comfortably. Mub is going up on top of the scaffolding. Kieran's going to follow him. Strange move by both players. And they've downed each other. Both players down. Kieran spots Mub in the liquor store. Gets a long range body shot. Can't do anything else. He's going to try a long range Molotov. Nowhere near. Mub managed to evade it comfortably. Trying to get a long range burst on Kieran. He's going to throw his own Molotov. And Kieran takes a hell of a lot of damage. Mub is going to press, but he's not going to get there quick enough. Decided to back off. Oh, he goes on top of the ambulance again, and it's new. Well, it has kind of worked this time. Both players down in each other again. For the second time in this game. Kieran now wearing armour. Can't find the right angle for the bomb. Manages to get a couple of body shots. Can't finish Mub off, though. Mub taking up a position behind. Kieran's now the one that got in the elevator position. It's worked for him despite dropping back down off. Mub didn't take advantage of Kieran beating those anim animations of getting up and down. Kieran now up by two. Smoke bomb comes in nowhere near again. Throwables not being put to good use in this game. Only Kieran really with a Molotov and a bomb. Mub not used any of them very wisely at all. Again, Molotov misses. Kieran gets that down comfortably, and he is up now by three. Mub has no idea what's going on, and that bomb was timed to perfection. Mub not managing to evade it and not being very aware situationally about where Kieran is. Kieran again, happy to wait for Mub to walk into his firing line. Mub knows where Kieran is this time, throws his own bomb, gets a bit of damage. Kieran can't get out of the way before Mub comes in with the burst rifle. And he does pull one back. Kieran's still up by three as this game enters the last three minutes. Bomb again from Kieran and another down. And I take it back about the throwables. He's put the last two to great work. And Kieran now up by four as we enter the remaining minute. And I cannot see Mub getting back into this. Probably guess from him not submitting footage that he lost. <laughs> that tends to be a trait when people don't submit footage. Uh, Kieran's still up by four. Both players downed each other again for the third time in this game. Uh, Mub has now switched up to a variable for some reason. Not sure why he decides to change it so late in the game when there's no chance of a comeback. He is making the scoreline a little bit more respectable, though, putting armour on himself as well. And as we enter the final minutes here, it's been a great game. Nice long range shots from Kieran, not giving Mub chance to take cover. And he wins this game by a comfortable four spawn lead. That's all from me, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. See you all in the next one. Bye for now.